mamas and welcome to the Mama Lounge. If this is your first time here, I'm Sarah, mama of two toddlers, and I do cleaning, cooking, haul, and review videos here on this channel. So if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing so that we can stay connected because I would love to connect with you. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys a quick toddler meal using my air fryer. And guys, I am so in love with my air fryer, and let me tell you why. The first thing I really liked with the new air fryer is the stainless steel pan versus the Teflon pan, as you can see in this video, mainly because stainless steel usually cooks food to a golden brown color, and it just makes sense to have this material inside the air fryer. The second thing I liked about this was the accuracy of the digital display. So while the manual dial was a little bit faster when turning the, to the preferred temperature, you couldn't really get an accurate reading if you wanted to heat in um, a different temperature than the four temperatures listed on the dial. So you kind of played a bit of a guessing game. And then lastly, I really liked the square sleek design versus the egg shaped design. It's just a personal preference of mine, obviously, and uh, that was just something I was happy about. So really impressed with my upgrade and I'm super excited to use it. If you haven't done so already, check out my grilled cheese sandwich in the air fryer video. This is a really great recipe as well if you're interested. Also, if you wanna jump into this movement of using air fryers, use my promo code lounge for 15% off at the link below and you can get started using these air fryers. They're awesome, you guys. A special thanks to New Air for sponsoring this video and sending me my upgraded air fryer. I absolutely love it. I love using air fryers and this is just a super cool bonus. So let's jump right into how I made this really easy, quick toddler meal that you can make in just minutes. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is turn the air fryer on. I already plugged it in. And I'm going to put it up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit going to be making tater tots and uh, dino chicken bites and I'm going to put them both in here so let's go up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit now I'm going to be probably cooking for 15 minutes but not straight through and this is I think uh, something that is not mentioned a lot I like to shake my stuff in there so that nothing gets too uh, crispy in one area and that it just cooks more thorough. It's called the shake and it's pretty popular if you know about air fryers, but it's not mentioned too much. So let's just put this down. I'm going to start out with just oops, eight minutes uh, to get it going. And then I'm probably going to shake it around four minutes. Not sure yet, but I'm going to just start at eight, probably stop it at four and then uh, start it again and just kind of check it. Dino bites. And then I'm also going to be putting in some of these organic tater tots. Probably just put the rest since it's almost gone. So they're all in here. Like that. And like I said before, I'm going to be shaking it up in just a quick moment here. So let's secure that in. I also wanted to point out that there's a little handle here. So when you wash it, the water doesn't get inside or a little uh, plastic cover. How cute, right? So I set it for 400, eight minutes on the clock. Let's start and let's wait. I waited a little longer because uh, I didn't hear it sizzle and there's a lot of stuff in here. So I did, I'm just gonna shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, and then we're gonna start it over and then I'm gonna add, so I did eight minutes, so it's about six minutes now. Uh, and I'm gonna just add another, oh, I guess you have to go all the way. Okay, let's wait till it's done and then we're gonna add a little more time. Okay, so they're sizzling even more. Can you hear that? Now they're done-ish, but I think I'm gonna give them another good mm, four minutes and we'll just kind of keep an ear out because you do hear them sizzling. So let's just do another shake. And we're gonna, let's, again, we're gonna have to go back up to 400. And the minutes now will go down to four. Check this out. See how they look. And I see they're done. 
What do you think? They look good to me. Let's serve them up. And here is the finished product. Look at those tots. I also paired it with some carrots, raspberries, and I put some sliced cucumbers as well for the kids. Um, and then I just sprinkled a little bit of salt on top. And then for their treat, I just did a gummy, so they should enjoy this meal. I just didn't do carrots for my daughter because she's a little too little, so I just put extra cucumber. guys that is it for today I really hope that you enjoyed this video don't forget that I have that 15% off coupon code for the stainless steel air fryer in the description for you and if you haven't already make sure you are subscribed to my channel so that you don't miss anything here in the mama lounge also I'll be doing a full video review on the dinner winner plates and some tips for picky eaters very soon so stay tuned for that and I will see you guys in the next video bye Create a song.